Welcome back to Infigyan my dear friends. In today's video we are going to solve one very interesting and challenging exponential equation from Math Olympiads. Equation is 2 power log x base 3 plus 10 times log x base 9 equal to 36. We have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started with one of the property of log. Log a if base is b square then we can write it is equal to half times log a base b and this property I will use here. So I can write our equation 2 power log x base 3 plus 10 times log 9 we can see base 9 we can write 3 square and then it is x. Right hand side is 36. Let's use this property. So I will be writing 2 power is log x base 3 plus 10 times. Now I can write half log x base 3 equal to 36. Now we can cancel 2 and 10 by writing over there. 5. So it is converting into 2 power log x base is 3 plus 5 times log x base is 3 right hand side 36. Now let us consider first substitution log x base 3 we can consider a. So this equation will become 2 power a plus 5 a equal to 36. 2 power a plus 5 a equal to 36. And our substitution is log x base 3 equal to a. Now I will take away 5 a from both sides. So I can write 2 power a equal to 36 minus 5a. Now I will use second substitution. Let us consider let 36 minus 5a equal to y. So from here I can calculate a. So I can write 5a will be 36 minus y or a is equal to 36 minus y divided by 5. So here I will be putting a and right hand side it is y already. So I can write 2 power a. a is 36 minus y divided by 5 and right hand side it is y. Now I will use property of exponent. It is a power b minus c. Anytime we can write a power b divided by a power c. Let's apply two LHS. So I can write 2 power 36 over 5 divided by 2 power y over 5. And right hand side is y. Now I will cross multiply. So we can write y times 2 power y over 5. Let me write here. y times 2 power y over 5 equal to 2 power 36 divided by 5. Now I can use one exponential property for this 2. I can write y times 2 can be written as e power ln 2 and then whole power is y over 5. As we know e raised to the power ln x any time it is equal to x we can use. Right hand side is 2 power 36 over 5. Now using the property a power b whole power c 
we can take the product in the exponents. So this will become y times e power y over 5 ln 2. And right hand side is 2 power 36 over 5. Now I will use lambda w functions property. It is x times e power x. Lambda w function. This value is x. So you can see it is x. So I need to multiply both sides with ln 2 over 5. Let's multiply. So I will write y ln 2 over 5 times e raised to the power y ln 2 over 5. Right hand side also 2 power 36 over 5 times ln 2 divided by 5. Now I will take both sides lambda w function. So I will be writing w. I will be writing here w. Now it is a times e raised to the power a. So this will give us a. That means y ln 2 over 5. And right hand side it is lambda w function 2 raised to the power 36 over 5 divided by 5 ln 2. Let's simplify RHS. So I will write here. Now this 2 we will change the base. How we can change? We can write lambda w function and then we can write it is e raised to the power ln 2 and then whole power is 36 over 5 ln 2 divided by 5. Now we can multiply both the powers. Lambda w function e raised to the power 36 ln 2 divided by 5 times ln 2 over 5. Now I will use one manipulation step. So I can write lambda w function and this power I will split as 16 plus 20 or 20 plus 16. 36 divided by 5 ln 2 times ln 2 over 5. Now using the property we can split our powers. So lambda w function e raised to the power 20 over 5 ln 2 times e raised to the power 16 over 5 ln 2 and times ln 2 over 5. Now you can see if I will cancel this will become e raised to the power 4 ln 2. 4 ln 2. Now this 4 I will take to the power of 2. So this will become lambda w function e raised to the power ln 2 raised to the power 4. Now this first term you can see e raised to the power ln 2 power 4. This is 2 power 4 which is 16. Let us write y ln 2 over 5. Right hand side we will be writing lambda w function. It is 2 power 4 times ln 2 over 5 times e raised to the power 16 ln 2 over 5. Now I can write lambda w function. This is 16 ln 2 over 5 times e raised to the power 16 ln 2 over 5. Now you can see if this is k, this is e power k, we are taking lambda w function, then we can write this equal to k. So I can write y ln 2 divided by 5, this value will be equal to 16 by 5 ln 2.
Now we can cancel ln2 divided by 5 both sides. So we are getting y value equal to 16. Now the turn of substitutions. Our first substitution was a equal to log x base 3 and second substitution was a equal to 36 minus y over 5. Let's find out a first. So I will write a equal to 36 minus y divided by 5. Now we calculated y equal to 16. Let's plug in. So I will be writing 36 minus 16 over 5. 20 over 5, so a equal to 4. Now I will write our first substitution. It was a equal to log x3. Log x with base 3 equal to 4. So from here I can write x is equal to 3 power 4. So our final answer becomes x is equal to 81. Let's verify our answer. So I will plug in. Let me write here verification. Let's put over here x is equal to 81. So I will begin with LHS. I can write 2 power log 81 base 3 plus 10 times log 81 base 9 and we have to check whether it is 36 or not. So I will be writing here 2 power log 3 power 4 base is 3 plus I can write this 10 over 2 using log property log with base 3 now because I have divided by 2 81 is 3 power 4. So this we can write 2 power 4. Here it is 5 times 4. Log 3 power 4. Base 3 is 4. Now this is 16 plus 20. Which is coming out 36. Which is our RHS. Hence verified this solution. And this brings the end of this video. I hope you will like this video also. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself. Bye bye.